right, guys. God bless you, and welcome to This Is It, 4, 3, 2, 1, guys. Um, hey, listen, I'm just checking in. I'm going to be here tomorrow. Um, I've been in bed for a couple days. I got the funk went down into my chest and <clears throat> got that thing going on. Anyway, um, I'm over the hump, I think. Um, <clears throat> I want to share with you guys something just very quickly. You all remember all the doves that were at the uh, Night Under the Stars? Well, I just want to show you some. You see that dove right there? Well, that that fell off the wall I have. It's got it's got all the um all the doves were cut out of those pieces of metal right there. And um this is one of this is one of the doves that's that's from the um the Ark event, the Night Under the Stars. Here, let me sit down like this. Hang on, sec, guys. Hang on one sec. Just give me bear with me one moment. Oh, shoot. Anyway, so I just want to show y'all something insane. <coughs> Pardon me. That's one reason I don't want to do a video. I'm dealing with this chest congestion. Anyway, but I was passing a board over the fence uh, to put up on this wall back here. And this one dove, out of all those doves that I have, I have, I have all the doves. And they're all part of a, an art project it's in the front of my house. And this one dove fell off. And so I was like, well, I'll just pick it up and put it right back where it came from on the fence. And it, they have magnets on the back. So they have magnets. So it's easy to put up and just stick it back onto that metal fence. <clears throat> anyway, so it fell and it was in the dark. And I looked around and I found it. And in my spirit, I heard, look at the back. Because there's prayers on the back. And... People write their names on the back and put a prayer. And you know what? I didn't I didn't react immediately to it. I didn't go, oh, okay. You know, I, I mean I heard it inside of me. I didn't react. I already had it and I and I stuck it on the wall. And this fell off again and it hit me in the head. So this dove just fell off again and went like this on my hat. And it went down to the ground and I had to hunt around in the dark for it. And uh because I'm trying to get this ready for to hang out with you guys. Um, and I'm trying to get it ready for a video. But again, I'm still dealing with that. I'll be here no matter what tomorrow's uh, not feeling well or not. I'll be here for sure tomorrow. Anyway, so this thing falls off again and hits me in the bill of that on the hat. And it goes down to the ground. And I start hunting around in the dark in the grass. <laughs> Like, where's the thing? And I pick it up and I hear, I hear the Lord tell me, pay attention. Look at the back of the dove. Okay. And so I look, look real close at it. Let's see if I can get it on here. So it says, Susie Harless. And it's got a heart and it says, Revelation 1.8. <clears throat> You know, I was supposed to have lunch with Susie today, uh, Susie and Eric Carlos here in San Antonio. And um, I wonder what the odds are that someone I was supposed to meet for lunch in San Antonio and someone who's become a, a close friend of mine, that her dove is the one that fell off out of all those hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of doves. And it didn't fall off once. It fell off twice and hit me in the head. It's like the Lord's going, wake up, son. And uh, when I when I looked up Revelation 1-8, just because of where we are and what I've been telling you and how often I've been telling you the same thing, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming, the king's coming, the king's coming, the king's coming, here comes the enemy as well, the whole thing's about to apex. Let me show you what Revelation 1-8 is, okay? So let's do that real quick. So if you'll just bear with me for just a moment. Um, uh, here we go. We're going to go to Esword. Um, I'm not going to break anything down. I'm just, it's going to be my biblical source. Just. Okay, Revelation 1.8. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the ending, 
saith the Lord, which is, which was, and which is to come, the Almighty. I mean, can you imagine uh, that that's the dove that fell off the, that wall of doves tonight? I'm going to be here tomorrow and do a video, no matter how I feel. <laughs> I'm going to be here no matter what. I wanted to do one tonight, but everyone's feeling low under the weather, too. Corey's in bed, and, <laughs> and again, I have this chest thing going on. Going on. Anyway, just wanted to share it with you guys before I, I go to bed. And I wanted to check in and let you guys know I'll be here tomorrow no matter what. I'll try and get some vids up during the day. But tomorrow evening, I plan on being here, you know, 6 o'clock-ish um, Central Standard Time, around 6 o'clock. So if I'm doing a video around 6 o'clock, it'll be going up around 7 or 7.30. Uh, my time, uh, and it could even be before that, just depends on how the Lord leads things, but um, I don't know what to say, except you see that sign behind me right there? You know it's true, right? I know it's true. Okay, I love you in Christ. God bless you guys.